No, we're not here to talk to you about dino DNA or West Nile. Chikungunya is loosely translated to contorted with pain, and it's also the name of a virus that's now being spread in the U.S. Tonight, the State Department of Health is confirming the first locally acquired cases of chikungunya fever, one in Palm Beach County, a second Miami-Dade County. The disease is spread through the bite of a mosquito. Dozens of cases have been reported in Florida this year, but all were contracted outside the U.S. Now, a man and a woman have contracted the disease locally. So what does it mean for them? According to the World Health Organization, chikungunya causes fever, severe joint pain, muscle pain, headache, nausea, rash, and more. Since 2004, chikungunya fever has reached epidemic proportions with considerable morbidity and suffering. And there's no cure. Symptoms are just treated. The CDC notes the disease has made its way to the U.S. just seven months after it was recognized in the Western Hemisphere. But some good news. Infection is rarely fatal, though pain can be severe and debilitating. The virus is not spread person to person, and infection is thought to provide lifelong immunity. The individuals who, who could have more concern are the very young newborns and of course the elderly over 65. It's unclear how quickly the virus might spread in the U.S., but in June, NBC's senior health writer reported it was spreading rapidly through the Caribbean, though she added in a recent article that that strain of the disease only spreads through one type of mosquito, and that type of mosquito is only found in the southern U.S. As CBS notes, the CDC and other health agencies had issued a travel warnings for several popular vacation destinations over the past few months because of the virus. But that's a bit of a moot point now. The CDC advises seeking medical care right away if you show symptoms of chikungunya. Thanks for watching. For Newsy, I'm Lauren Zima.